Hey guys, well I have some news. Zy Always Seek now has a website. Something I have wanted to do for a very long time and I finally did it and it's now a place I can collate all of my research and my esoteric diagrams and if for some reason I ever disappear off YouTube or I ever disappear off any of the other social media platforms I use, you'll be able to find me on ZyAlwaysSeek.com. So just a little bit of a look around as you scroll down. I've got a little bit of a welcome to my new website. And every week I'm going to post some teachings from the Colburn Bible as well as from Manly P. Hall. And I'm also going to do a weekly blog. So I've got three blogs that are already up that you can read. And I've got links to my channel. Uh, this site also hosts uh, Vimeo. So if for some reason I ever do disappear off YouTube, I can re-upload all of my videos to Vimeo and I can still host it uh, on the website. So you will be able to still access the videos. And these are all of my contact details. I've actually started a Twitter account. I haven't really had one before. I'm still kind of use, you know, learning how to use the platform. Um, so if anybody wants to follow me on my Twitter account, I will upload probably daily at least um, some quotes, uh, a couple of videos. But every week I will definitely be uploading my blog to Twitter as well. So uh, if you go back to my website and we have a look at the Philosopher's Toolbox, you'll see that I've uploaded all of my esoteric diagrams. So they're now all in one place. You don't have to scroll around looking for them on the MeWe group or anywhere else. They're all there. And also we've got the um, Kabbalah Tree of Life overlays, which I love doing and I'm probably going to do some more because every now and then I do actually see a painting and I know that the Tree of Life will, you know, overlay over top of it, but I just don't get the time. So I'm hoping that I can add to that. I've got some um, mythology diagrams, so basically just an overview um, of the different mythologies, some selected ones and... Um, gives you a bit of an idea about what the core teaching is or the symbolism and the hidden truths beyond the story because that's really what all of our mythologies are or they just are a way to encode information. Um, I've also got the latest video series that I'm doing, The Sacred Science of the Soul. I am really enjoying doing this series. I'm trying to at least get one out every couple of weeks. And um, there's also the recommended texts and I've got them all down here. So anything that you are looking for, I hopefully have on this list. But if not, this website here, the Sacred Text Archive, is awesome. It's pretty much got everything that you need. So that's pretty much the extent of my website i do have a little members area where you can log on i'm not really sure what that does yet so thanks to anybody that's actually joined up um, i'm going to find out what all of these things do so just bear with me i am only just uh, new to this platform and building a website so i'm kind of on this huge learning curve and i'm probably going to make some mistakes and there's probably going to be things that um I'm not using to the full potential because I'm really not yet getting a handle of it. So just bear with me. So anyway, I will put my link for the iowaseek.com underneath this video, but it's also on the channel uh, homepage. I've got it there as well, and I will put it under all the other videos as well and try and basically use this platform as much as I can. And so look out for the blogs. The blogs will be uploaded every week. And as I said, there will be new teachings added as well um, from Manly P. Hall and the Colburn Bible every week too. And, you know, as I go on, I will be adding new things to the website. I've got some guest writers that will be uh, added to the blogging section. And I've got some overlays uh, 
that Chris has done that I want to also add. So I'll have a page here where other students of the teachings can basically display any of their diagrams and their work and their research as well. So anyway, I just wanted to let everybody know. So I uh, hope everybody's well and as always, peace out.